I worked on the front lines all through COVID and that was difficult enough to deal with that stress of the pandemic. And then to be re-diagnosed with stage four cancer just added a whole nother level of stress and anxiety. And like, now I really can't catch COVID. <laughs> In 2011, I was diagnosed with stage three breast cancer. Uh, went through chemo treatment, radiation, um, bilateral mastectomy surgery. Um, recovered from that and thought I was cured and felt something else again. Got it checked out and found out that it was cancer and that it was stage four with metastatic disease. Um, I'm back on chemo, um, other treatments and just keeping going. Um, I just, one day at a time, that's this rock. Like, <laughs> one day at a time. Someone may think, oh, it's a little rock, but when you're going through something very difficult, it, it's huge. I was going through a difficult time after treatment with side effects, got back to work, and this beautiful rock was sitting in front of my door to my shop that says, you're amazing. So obviously someone out there thinks maybe I'm amazing. <laughs> I'm Beth Hodgson. I'm an artist and I have had a paintbrush in my hand since I was probably old enough to do so. When the pandemic started, I, I searched deep and tried to come up with how can I spread happiness and joy and optimism knowing that we really needed it. And Something came to me, rock painting. It was something that I could do at home and then I could take these rocks and spread them throughout our community. At some point along that journey, it hit me. What would it be like right now to receive a cancer diagnosis or to be going through cancer treatments? What would that feel like? I was really drawn to calling up the hospital and saying, all right, uh, how can I help you? Can I help you with your rock garden? And from there, it, things have just grown and grown. The words I typically gravitate toward are words of inspiration and hope and kindness and restoration and healing. I tend to use words like heal or peace or calm, kindness, love, faith, Sayings like, you got this, or you can do this, or this will pass. Words that I think will resonate to people and give them a lift. I hope that these words connect with people and they give them hope. And they give them a reason to hang on and to fight and to find strength. Or give them comfort when they need it. My first experience with the rock garden was uh, two weeks ago when I first had my first visit here at the cancer center. It brought tears to my eyes because it brought a sense of peace and comfort to me for my first visit because it's very scary when you're being diagnosed with cancer, um, especially when you're coming by yourself. I will continue like I always have. I'm a strong warrior woman and I will do that. <laughs> Monica Strong. <laughs> yeah. So I am grateful for the artists and the people that have taken the time to make these rocks for people like myself and others as well. It's been a rough journey, but it's, it is a journey and, and I'll just keep following that road and where it leads me and hope for the best.